Linda. Hello, my name is Luna and welcome to Step Into It. Thank you so much for being here and this is my third video. I said that right, right? This is my third video. I'm so excited. I'm shooting this at night again. Like the last video. Ugh. My days are just longer. I don't know why this is happening the moment you decide i want to do something and your day becomes crazy but nevertheless i'm here so what are we talking about today today we're talking about finding your why mm -hmm. finding your why because in my experience um i've been looking for that why people talk about the why and it has been such a journey for me to find that um, what is your why your why it's like your purpose it's what keep you going uh, even if you don't feel like it so i've been having a problem i've been having a really hard time to find my reason why you know i'm i'm hard working and i love you know to learn new stuff and just um be involved i love you know working hard if you know there's a job to do i'm there i'm gonna do it uh but you can't um in my experience now is as it doesn't matter it doesn't matter what you know what how good you are at your job or whatever the heck you know you are doing if you don't have a reason behind um whatever you're doing life comes in if you don't have the reason why if you don't know your why why am i doing this you can't go you can't you can't keep push pushing and that's why it's so important to find your why so i i've been really struggling uh with that finding my why i i try you know i thought it was my mom and i try it was my niece i try i i, I thought it was myself it's like okay yeah um you know i should be a good enough reason to do something because i want to be good because i want to be in a better position because i just love myself <laughs> that that should be a reason you know that should be my why um but it wasn't i wasn't quite right um so what did i do what did i do to find my why because i found it i found it <laughs> after so many try but i finally found it i found my why how did i find my why so like i say i've been reading a lot of books and listening to vid to motivation videos um i have audio book and listening to books and stuff and just trying meditating and asking god where is my why it was just a struggle for me to find the why so how did i do it how did i do it ask me go on ask me how okay i'll tell you i know i'm being annoying right now just tell us luna um yeah here's how i find my why um so after reading after listening I was like okay i'm just gonna work as hard as i can i'm just gonna do whatever the heck i have to do but at a certain point i was just um tired of not getting anywhere one day i was just listening to tony robin robin is it <sighs> tony robin tony tony robin robin tony robin i was listening to tony and i heard something very interesting i was like ooh yeah let's explore that i heard something you say that just touched my soul and made so much sense to me and i was like oh that's it 
that's it that 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 must be it that must be it and what he says like the reason why um we said he said that the reason why people change it's because of pain let me say it again the reason why people change it's because of pain i was like yes yes and yes and yes yes this makes absolutely perfect perfect sense the reason why people change is because of pain the reason why people change it is because of pain let me explain to you what does that mean to me when i heard that i was like yes every time that i change anything in my life it's because because of pain pain of something i, I was hurt or just life came on crashing and i was like i changed liking it or not pain change people like pain change people you get wiser and sometimes you get bitter about life pain change you for the better or the worst it just does it just does change you how did that how did that help me found my why because i was like woman woman every time you have changed in your life it's because of pain so are you gonna sit here and be a victim all the time that something must happen to you something someone has to hurt you life has to crush you so that you decide to change is that what you want because remember remember what has been happening to you this happened you lose this someone eats your money and all those things and do you want things to keep happening to you because it's gonna happen life is gonna happen so how did i bring that to make that to be my reason why because like i have enough pain in my life i don't need more for me to change i have to make a decision to change i have to change my behavior i have to change me i have to change me and act accordingly because when life come come at me i mean i'm ready when life come at me i'm ready it's like yo you want to go you you want to step outside yeah let's step outside like let's do this i'm not gonna be a punk ass so i made a decision and i made a decision that yo luna you are not gonna let life bully you like Hell no, you're not gonna let change bully you into changing. You're not gonna let let pain bully you into changing. You have to change, you have to toughen up, you have to decide who you wanna be in this life and how you want to 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 to, to live your life. And when life show up, when that bully show up and then you you know, you're ready. You're ready and then let's go, let's let's step outside. I'm not gonna make it easy for you to bully me, to beat me up. I mean, I'm gonna punch back. That's what I'm gonna do. I mean, because life is life. It's gonna hit you hard, but you have to be like, yo, yeah. I mean, you know, boom. Also, like, you have to do that. You have to learn how to punch back. You have to stay ready. But the goal is not to always, the goal is not to always, you know, dodge the bullet. It's like, you you may get punched in the face, but you know, some of those punches, you mean just dodge it. And with that, you may just survive. You may just make it. You may like, yeah, you beat me, but you did not kill me. Like, <laughs> I'm still here. You know, because if you just wait for life to happen to you, if you just w wait for change to happen and pain to happen to you, 
you're not gonna make it i just realized like yo if more of those things keep happening to me and i'm just sitting here and just waiting to take the the, the, the punch to take it i'm not gonna make it i'm not gonna it's gonna be really hard so what do i do i have to learn to stay ready like Oh, you want to step outside? Yeah, let's step outside. You may just kick my ass. That's pretty certain because look at me. I'm a very small woman. I mean, but uh, we're going to step outside. If that's, you know, I'm not going to let you bully me. Like, who do you think you are? The moment, the moment I heard the phrase, people change it because of pain. I was like, Ta-da! Yes! That is my reason why. It's because pain. Pain changed me. In the past. And I'm not gonna let it to happen again. The reason why I changed in the past. I'm gonna take that. And turn that into gold. I mean... The pain, the pain of seeing uh, someone that I love um, being sick and, you know, sickness happens. Sometimes you can't, you can't, you can't change it. It just happened. But instead of being in this situation that you are just, you know, trying and, and praying and being so hopeful and, and how can I say Instead of being in the situation where your mind is just thinking about how this person, you know, about the well-being of this person, you start thinking about money, you start thinking about um, this and that, if it's pretty irrelevant. It should not be a question. It should not be, we should not be in a situation where someone is sick, someone is not feeling well, the, and you worry it's about money. I don't want to be in that situation again. That is pain. And that I decide that to be my why. I do not want to be in that situation again where someone that I love is, is in pain. And my worry is about money. I want to have the money. And I just was like, yo, what can we do? Like, yeah, we need to do this. Let, yeah, let's go. Here it is. How much do you want? Not means like, oh, yo um how much was it again Ooh, ooh, okay oh you know that should not be i do not i do not want to stress over money ever again like no if someone's sick yeah i mean my presence alone should be like yo this person you know is not even supposed to wait here because she's gonna pay i want to be in, I, I the other thing is pretty ghetto i do not want to be in that situation and that i made that my reason why i do not want to be in that situation i don't want shit because people are gonna get sick it's part of life and that is a change but i should not be worried about money money should be there so that's why i was like that's my reason that is my reason that was my answer the answer to my why it was pain the answer to my why was pain the pain of seeing my mom going into suffering and not having the money to help the pain of seeing my family going to certain situations and it's not just about money it's about time not having the time to invest into that because not having that you know it's like oh my best friend is getting married and i can't even fly to go and and and, and be present and be there for her because that girl i love her to death and you know and even if i have money to fly even if i can fly and go and and enjoy the day but is 
I can't afford that one way or the other. You know, my at work, I'm a, I have to be at work because if I'm not at work, I will get fired. So it's just that it's just the freedom. It's the freedom. So what? I it that's the pain. It's the freedom. It's not feeling, not having the freedom of of doing, uh, what you're supposed to do. When life comes at you, because you are tied down to certain situation that you know. If if you made the decision, if you work hard, if you you know you 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 made that decision prior to this this situation, you're not gonna be in 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 this position right now. You're gonna be free to just take a flight and fly home. No, just the freedom, the freedom of doing whatever the heck you want to do. You don't have it because you didn't make a decision to change your life. Mm -hmm. So that's that's pain. That's pain because things is gonna come, something coming, and then your boss is like, um, the business can't afford to have you out for three weeks or two weeks. So no hmm? Hmm? just the freedom of that that freedom of having time of prioritizing certain things in your lives like yo this is important to me i know this job is important but this is important to me too i need to give someone a hug because sometimes we just need it and i'm going there so with that and i made that i made i made a decision i made a decision that i'm changing now and that's my why that's my why mm -hmm. so that was the first thing he talked about and then he added this Oh, the guy is just full of gold. He added, change is automatic, but progress is not. Did you hear that? Change is automatic, but progress is not. I mean, it's the signs. Like, yes! Yes! People keep, things keep changing. Things keep changing my life. Because I'm just sitting here and Corona comes. I'm just sitting here and 154,000 variant of Corona just showed up in our gates. We did not ask for it. But if you sit your ass at home and not doing anything, there's no progress gonna happen. Nothing's gonna happen. Yes. Those things keep happening. But progress? Oh, my dear. You have to put your back into it. I mean, you have to step into it. And I was like, yeah. I would like to step into it. So that even, even if change happen automatically, there's some progress. I'm better, I can handle it better, and I know how to at least manage it at, at some level, right? Those were my two precious revelations from Tony Robin. Robin. Let's just keep it to that. <laughs> this change and this pain that's my why change happen automatically but progress not so what do i do i step into it i step i step into everything that i want i step into the role of being amazing of working for my money of working for my physique of working for being a better me pain the pain that happened because pain keep happening i use it as fuel as 
I I do not want to see my mom in that position again. I do not see myself in that position again. What what happened yesterday? I don't want to say it. I don't want to see myself into that again. So what do I do? I better myself. I work on myself every single day so that I have the money, I have the freedom, and I have the, the mental strength to deal with stuff when life come for me. I mean, I'll be ready. When it comes for me, I'll be ready for it. That's my reason why. But I'm gonna use what happened to morph me into this beautiful butterfly ready to fly i hope you got something out of this i hope this help you if you're out there struggling to find your reason because i know what that is and i believe this is the end of me struggling uh, on this and since I found it oh it hasn't been long it hasn't been long but since I found it there's just this thing where you know I, I sit here and I'm procrastinating on my my phone and it's like back of my mind's like pain like oh okay bye bye I have to do this i have to get this done and oh change you know just the back of my mind this thing is now there it's like you remember you remember that face your mom made that day it's like oh yeah you remember that face your dad made that day you remember that face your sister made that day because of money remember the stress you went through because of this it's like oh yeah i stopped procrastinating it's taken. Is it easy? No. It's still there. I'm still procrastinating. But the moment I catch myself into that situation, I'm like, dang. I'm out of here. I'm not doing this anymore. And I'm using this, you know, I don't know how, how this is good for my mental health. But I'm using the pain of the past. To fuel me. To fuel me. I'm using the pain of the past to fuel me. To move my ass and, and go after my, my, my goals and dreams. And I'm using the fact that, you know, um, change. Something can happen at any moment. Change can happen at any moment. Am I going to be ready for this? Am I mentally, physically, emotionally, financially ready for this? Am I going to be ready for that? So how do I get myself ready for that? And to work on myself and not sleep on myself. Let that help you into your journey in life. So thank you so much for watching this video. Uh, thank you for being with me for this long. Um, so please, 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 please like, subscribe, and comment below. And tell me if this helped you to find the reason why. Uh, and if not, please don't stop. Keep, keep looking. That's what I'm gonna keep trying, keep getting. If if life don't you, I like, keep trying, keep trying, and keep asking yourself question. What is my reason? Keep you found it. Keep your eyes open to your reason, and you found it. So again, like, subscribe, and comment below. Okay, thank you. I'll see you next. Tuesday.